How to fix if your screen timeout goes back to 30 seconds when you've set it to a minute or relatively a few more hours. Hey everybody, welcome back to our channel. I am Bimal from App Guide. In today's video, I will simply show you how you can fix if your pop-up or your screen timeout goes back to 30 seconds even when you've set a relatively higher time. But before we get started, as always, if you are new to our channel, make sure to leave a like, hit the subscribe button, and without any further ado, let's get started with today's video. So screen timeout basically means Means that whenever you're not conducting any type of activities you want a certain time to be set it to automatically light out but then uh, even if you've set it to a minute or two minutes or five minutes somehow automatically it is reverting back to 30 seconds so I will simply show you what the issue is over here as well if I go ahead and then open up settings and then if I go to let's say display and I might have the option called screen timeout so basically I have set set to five minutes but even if when you set it to five minutes it is reverting back to 15 seconds 30 seconds or relatively a lower time there is only one reason for it and that is that you have turned on low power mode so let me repeat that again even when you have set to two, two minutes five minutes and it keeps reverting back to 30 seconds it is because you have set your power mode to save the battery and that automatically actually reverts it back to 30 seconds now this happens mostly on iphone and it also actually works a similar way on android devices as well when you come back you will basically not be able to change the screen timeout to 30 seconds However, if that doesn't help, the other thing I could also recommend you to do, if, if it is a bug, likely it could also be a bug, so you could go to settings and then you could go to software update, so tap on software update and then tap on download and install. If there are any type of updates available, even if 50 or 100 megabytes of update, simply make sure to update your firmware to the latest version, make sure that you have actually updated it and hopefully one of these would likely fix your issue. If it did help solve the issue, then make sure to leave a like like and subscribe to the channel if you have any more questions queries or doubts simply also make sure to leave them down below thank you very much for watching till the end and see you soon in our next video